Hello. Hi, I'm Mr. Bell. I'm going to talk to you about how to get the Respondus Lockdown browser, browser set up so you can take the exams for this course. So, I'm going to be show you I'm going to show you how to do this on the uh, Econ 201 uh, online course. And so um, there's going to be uh, just so you know, so there's going to be a, a Respondus prep test, right? So a, a test you can take so you can download the Respondus browser and just test it out as you get going so you can understand, um, so you can be ready for the exams, okay? So where, where I'm going to find the prep test, so it's going to be, uh, there's going to be a link in the Getting Started page uh, or the module for your course. You can also go to coursework and I'll queue it up here right at the beginning here you see this one right here respondus lockdown browser prep test that's going to be the prep test you're going to take and what happens is is when you click on this as a student if you do not have the respondus browser uh, on loaded onto your computer what you're going to be able to do then is you go to take the prep test like this and you go ahead and click on take test uh, the first thing you're going to be able to do right here you see this little link right here is you're going to be able to download the Respondus Lockdown Browser from the link as you get in and get going on the test. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. Okay. And then it's going to bring up this screen where it's going to allow me to, to look at an overview of what the Lockdown Browser is, if my system is compatible or not, and if I uh, am able to then download it and uh, take the test using Respondus. So um, it, you can do this on a on a Windows computer. You're going to need Windows um, 10, or you can also do this on a Mac computer. So you can click on this this little link down here on the bottom if you need a Mac version. Currently, there is no version for uh, Chromebooks, for example. You're not going to be able to do it on a Chromebook. If you're close to campus and you uh, don't have a, an option. Of where to take it you can always come into a lab so all the labs on campus uh, at the Caldwell Center um, the center or the main campus here in Ontario any lab a TVCC lab is going to have the Respondus browser downloaded onto it so you can use any of the labs to do this as well okay so this is just a follow-up so once I'm at that screen that I was at right so I was able to download uh, and start the installation of the Respondus Lockdown Browser. Once you have it installed, so you have to go in there and you have to accept the, um, the agreement and, and download that to your computer, right? So now I have what's called the Respondus Lockdown Browser on my computer. So I, in order to install it, right, first you may be in Windows Explorer, you may be in uh, Google Chrome, whatever um, you can be, uh, any browser right that you're going to be using you're going to use that browser to go out there and and initiate that right that usually the one you usually go and get into your uh, canvas and, and do your homework using right uh, now in order to take the exam what you have to do is you have to close those down and you have to open up what's called the respondus lockdown browser so it's an actual browser that you have to open up right so you got to go in here uh, to your start menu for example and you've got to go and find your lockdown browser so mine's right here so as soon as I click this the lockdown browser begins and it's going to get everything set up for me it's, it'll basically prep my computer so that I can uh, open up the exam and take it in a um, kind of a, a proctored environment so I'm gonna be able to do that so now All right, so real quick. So once you get that lockdown browser open, what's gonna happen is you are going to, uh, it's gonna bring up the browser, right? And it will actually bring up, what the browser will open will be your login into Canvas, okay? So it'll log you into Canvas. That'll be the first screen that pops up. So put your um, username in there, right? Student, uh, basically your email and then your password in there. And then you're going to want to uh, navigate to the, cl the class, right, and the exam. Navigate in there to the right class and to the exam you want to take, and you'll be able to open it up and take the exam. So, all right. Happy testing, and we'll see you later.